Morning everybody. This morning I'm going to be doing Thaycroft. Now I must admit I don't really know much about Thaycroft but I used to come past Thaycroft in my cycling days I used to it was a regular route for me to and from wherever I needed to go especially if I were going out towards Nottingham but as you're driving or when you're cycling especially you don't really take much notice of these places so today I mean I don't as I said I don't really know much about Thaycroft at all so I'm just going to showcase it a little bit for you so just up there uh, so just up there is where the uh, Windsor Warehouse shoes and uh, the Consort Suite as we used to know it uh, I've just drove past it and it's called the Consort Hotel now uh, so I would call this the top side of Thaycroft uh, and there's just a few little shops here but uh, Look, look at look at this here. I'm just going to turn you around. In fact, I'll, I'll turn you around now so you can, uh, and I'll just talk over and uh, just show you what we uh, what what we're going to be viewing. So we've got this place here. Look, it's called Top Club. Now, I don't know what that actually means. I don't know if it means it's a top top club for snooker and pool, etc. Or it means the top club because it's what we'd call top of Thaycroft. But uh, it's not on top of a hill really. I mean it's not that, like that one at Thriber. Which is on top of a hill and everybody calls it the top club. Thriber top club. So it might be a bit noisy as well because it's, as I say, it's a busy main road. I think I've done about four or five of these spotlights and uh, what I've noticed in all, the, all these spotlights I've done is uh, hairdressers and nail and beauty parlors so I'm not going to point <laughs> I'm not going to point them out to you but we'll just see how many there is so here we go look that distex there is a computer shop. You don't see many of them in uh, these little. Oh dear. You don't see many of these in uh, these community hubs, even though there is one at Bramley. So there's two hair and beauty shops there. So I'll just walk further on for you. And I know I said I weren't going to point them out to you, but I can't really help it because there's another one there, <laughs> which is, look, from there, two, three. Have you ever seen that? Uh, the, it's like an antiques place that comes on TV. Uh, bargain on. Is it bargain on? Where they go around and uh, I absolutely can't stand it to be fair but my wife watches it and at the end of the week or the end of the, the, that episode they go to an auction room and this is one of them auction rooms that they come to Paul Bayton anyway we've got a standing fish there look standing fish sandwich co-op air and beauty tanning lounge how many is that now must be five Where them, where them groups of shops are over the road there I just remember a pub being there it was like a black and white Tudor style pub I don't know what they called it though I don't know if you can read that 
I just, I didn't even know this place were here. I thought it was a water in the taff. It is a water in the taff. And I didn't even know if their craft had a colliery. I always like to see these cenotaphs. Not because of, I'm morbid, it's because of uh, the, the, you know, the fallen heroes, if you like. Me, uh, I know it's nothing to do with aircraft, but uh, my wife's a World War II historian, so it resonates with, uh, with me a little bit. I don't know if you're getting a lot of wind noise on this microphone at all. Now that's a place you don't see very often. I'm going to cross over now. Not many of these community hubs have got these places. Picture framing shop. So if you want to know, if you want that uh, special picture framing and you haven't got it to, can't find a frame to fit, they'll probably make you a frame up. So I'm just moving down now to these next banker shops. It, it's not so I'll, I'll I'll just show you where we're going. Look, so that's where we've come from. That's them shops I've just passed there. And then if you go down here, look, and where that tick, where that tree is there is the next group of shops and there is there is a shop here that I know of uh, and it's uh, like a bog one of them bargain bull shops the chap who used to uh, go cycling with us he owned it uh, and he got me all he ordered me all the Prosecco for me uh, daughter's wedding it's a club here look they craft miners right. I might yeah I was just saying on the my video I didn't even know they craft had it colliery oh right okay um, yeah I think it shut in 1991 shut in ni hang on I'm not video you yeah. It sh shut in 1991, where was it? Where, where was it then? Um, where Cumwell Lane, that's where access where Where Cumwell Lane is? Yeah. On that, that, that... No, so at the top of this road, yeah? if you turn off and walk New Orchard Lane, or New Orchard Road, um, that'll take you up to where it were. Alright, oh, I didn't even know that. Cheers. So what I'll do is I'll walk down this side, show you show you what shops are on offer, and see how many more nail bars and beauty salons we can see, and then I'll take you up the other side. So I'm guessing it's going to be like any other place. So that bogging book shop, we're here. Now, I don't know whether that shut down or whether it opens later. Betting, betting shop looks shut down. Charity shop. Like I say, it's like any other place, isn't it? Vape shops. I said in my last one, Inter, where is there not a vape shop?
There you go, look. Your, your continental barber shop. There's got to be another one somewhere. <laughs> ah, there's a coffee shop there, look. You know why I'm not going in coffee shops. Pharmacy. A spa. No, it's not a spa. Looks like a, a group of shops that's closed. Just advertising them. What's further up on that bad bend? Faircroft Library. But look what it's called. Gordon Bennett. So we've, so we've done that side now. As I say, it's not uh, it's not very big, but it just covers your essential shops. The only shop that the only shop that I've seen that out of the ordinary, really, is that. Uh, picture framing shop oh I never that, that barber shop there good fellas not a notice on shutters so I don't know if that's shut down or not but you normally get them in twos don't you or threes have you been counting to keeping count on air salons and nail shops. There's one there. Traces. Charity shop. Heinz Nails. Heinz Nails. Oh, and another barber shop. Hold on a minute. Barber shop, barber shop, charity shop, charity shop, and another charity shop. And I've just seen there's just two more now to cover here. Look. Another little cafe there. Dog grooming shop. That looks like an indoor ball in indoor balls place. I've never seen one of them before. And then here we've got a Faircroft Motor Spares and Cycle Accessories place. So basically that's your Faircroft uh, spotlight. Just like any other place, really. Uh, just to serve the, uh, its community. So, as I said, then the next one is going to be Worth, and then I'm going to finish them. Unless somebody sends me a message and said, "Come and come and do this place, or go and do that place, and try this coffee shop that's highly recommended," or a coffee shop indeed gets in touch and says, "Come and show us off." I mean, you can, have, you can have a free coffee. <laughs> hey, that was a good idea, that. Let's, let's do a campaign for it. Anyway, I'll see you on the next thing. I'll see you.